this is the absolute least bad stretch in Lions history because <laughs> they've they've managed to avoid the two game loss, two two losses in a row, two game losing streak in the last what twenty three games. So it's been a good run. It's been a really really good run, and they're set up very well to have success this season. Do they need to play better? Yes. Have they shown that they can and proven that they can? Yes. It would help to get some people healthy, but even if they don't, they're still set up for a strong finish to the year. 248-539-9797. Let's go to Andrew next. Hi, Andrew. What's going on today, fellas? We're doing good. Okay, so my thing with golf in – it's a few things. First, is we do not need to extend him. He's still under contract for another year. So there's no need to extend him. He's still under contract. Two, the re- I don't believe in even if he does win one playoff game that we should extend him because we. I don't believe that he's the quarterback that's going to take us to where we need to be. He's a stabilizer. And the reason he's not in the, uh, with the Rams is because – it's not just because of the turnovers, but he would not take the shots downfield. The shots that were there, he wouldn't take or couldn't make. Therefore, that's why they had to get rid of him. Like, you can't turn the ball over and don't take the shots down the field. Because Matthew Stafford led the league in turnovers the year they won the Super Bowl, but he also took the shots. So the, the, the earlier, when he went through the 380, whatever it was, consecutive passes without turning the ball over, I mean, that, 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 can, be part, that can be part of his game. And that's something that I think – is he needs to make better decisions with the ball. He needs to be protected better. I suspect that there's going to be guys that are only going to get better. And are, I mean, they got essentially two and really three weapons in the pass game with Laporta, Jamison Williams, and Jameer Gibbs that are all rookies that should get even better at route running and or, and develop better chemistry with his quarterback, this but, quarterback. But so it, I, I'm I'm looking forward to that time. Okay, but this is the one thing though. You guys, you realize you're saying how everything has to be perfect no. in order for him. No, to I be just said better. Almost good. I just said better. Okay. Okay. So with that being said, with that being said, our defense is not going to is not where it needs to be. So our quarterback, somebody has to step up. The defense is not getting the pass for us. Our linebackers that are not getting good pass coverage and allowing things like. The Lions, I honestly see them going back into the playoffs, uh, losing three out of the four next games. And I see them being a tough situation because also next year the coordinator, offense coordinator is going to be gone. How have they, so how have they, how have they gone 17-5 and five in the last 22? Because they've been playing a lot of bad teams. It wasn't In that time frame, they haven't played a lot of good teams. You say the Chiefs, right. but the Chiefs are nowhere near as good as they've been, especially with all the receiving drop. All the, uh, receive Last year, the Packers were playing for a playoff spot. This year, they have a better strength of schedule than teams like Dallas, better wins than Dallas. I, I mean, seriously, my man here just described a team that's pretty bad. I just listened to him describe a team that has a lot of problems. And they've gone 17 and 5. Why? Because they haven't played anybody. I mean, I, I'm sorry, but they played a bunch of teams that are doing things like battling for the playoffs. I, I, they're either in the playoffs or battling for the playoffs. Haven't played anybody? I guess when you're good and most of the teams are worse than you, they look like nobody. You know, when you're at the top. And you go, oh, so what? They beat the Packers earlier this year, the Bears, the Falcons, the Saints, who are in a playoff chase. They beat those teams, but they're not anybody because you're better than them. I, I'm, I, I don't know, man. I don't know why we're trying so hard to discredit this team. That is nine and four. Nine and four. Finished last season really, really hot. Carried it over into this year. He just described a really bad football team. And then, I mean, all those teams that the Lions beat, yeah, they're not as good as the Lions. That's the point. Not, it, it, we're not desperate. We're not desperate. We're not. 
Do they need some fine-tuning? Yes. Do they need to play better? Are there guys that should be singled out that can play better? Yes. And golf is one of them. But honestly, (laughs) they're not even that good. We know what not good looks like. We've all been in Detroit together. We know exactly what not good looks like. This isn't it. 